Good morning, everyone. It is Monday again, January something. I think it's the 8th, and I am headed back to work for the week. So here's what I'm taking for beverages this morning. Zero point coffee with one tablespoon dairy star fat free half and half for zero smart points. My tea is the teeny skinny tea. I have one teaspoon of tea for zero smart points, and then I also have the juice of a full lime inside as well. That is my tea for zero smart points. Over here, this tea is for later tonight, but I'm gonna steep it all day. So I have one bag of the teeny colon, because it's my last bag, and then I have two of this dieter's tea. So we're gonna see how that works tonight. I am steeping it now, and yeah, three bags. And oh, this stuff I just wanted to show you guys. Big shout out, I didn't think I liked this stuff, and I really only like it because it's lime flavored. Um, but it's a really, really good water substitute. I don't like drinking water. I just don't like water. But this stuff has been really, really good. So I am enjoying this a lot. I still prefer to have a soda or something more with more flavor for dinner. But this is a really good water substitute. I'm impressed. And this, um, what is this? I don't know how much. Oh, this liter bottle was only a dollar at the dollar store. So I am enjoying that. This is my lunch today. So um, I am trying to save some money this year. So I'm doing, trying to budget better on groceries and I am cleaning out the freezer in the refrigerator this week for lunches. So this is a Weight Watchers Fresh meal that I had gotten earlier this year and I put it in the freezer because I didn't want to have that many smart points. So now I'm gonna eat it. Um, <clears throat> it is still frozen, so hopefully it thaws throughout the day, and then I will just microwave it. So it is eight smart points, but it has grilled salmon in it, so I'm subtracting two points for the salmon, um, because salmon is now zero, and I'm counting this for six smart points. So it's grilled salmon with citrus butter served over orzo and vegetables. So that is my lunch. That is going to be six smart points. And then my snacks, I'm having a banana and then um, an egg. I'm gonna poach it in the microwave at work. And I just have this cup because it works really well for poaching eggs. So um, both the banana and the egg, zero smart points. So everything I'm taking with me to work today to have before dinner is going to be just six points. This is the first time you've seen me today at all. Because, why Eddie? Because it's been raining all day. And I, once you get in your little office cocoon and it's raining outside and cold, I just don't wanna go anywhere. So I did not. I didn't take any walks. I did, I did my planner at lunch for the full hour and I just got stuff done. So I did just run no, I just ran three miles, so um, I'm, I want to reduce my running, but I feel so much better when I just run, so I need to find like the happy medium, the mileage that feels best for me physically and mentally, but is not breaking down my back and my knees and my hips and my butt, so I don't know, three miles might be it. Um, one mile a day is absolutely perfectly fine unless I'm trying to do a speed mile and that kind of hurt so <clears throat> I don't know it's just all a balance but I have to be really 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 careful this week to go nice and slow and take a really easy because I cannot injure anything before the half marathon Sunday because I have to do it even if I crawl I will never ever quit a race I will crawl to the finish line Anyway, so I've had nothing exciting to report today, except that I overcooked my egg and it wasn't as good as I wanted it to be. The Weight Watchers meal that I was concerned about the points on, when I went to track it in the tracker, I tracked a Weight Watchers fresh salmon with orzo and it popped up at, 
I think it was five points. <laughs> so all of that deliberation, I was like, oh, how many points should I subtract for the salmon? Because I don't remember even how much salmon used to be. So um, it popped up the right amount. So I tracked five points for that. And um, that's all I've had so far today. Well, and the other snacks, I've had five points. So I had five points plus the egg and the banana. And that's it. And we are headed home. I'm gonna shower and make dinner. I'll show you guys what I'm having. Okay guys, nine o'clock and here is dinner for me tonight. This is one of my favorite, favorite, favorite low points meals ever. This is spaghetti squash with chicken and tomatoes. And now with chicken at zero points, this entire plate is zero points. And I am so, I mean, this is a full plate. It's loaded. I am infamous for making way too much of this when I make it, but I just love spaghetti squash and I just, I love the whole combination. So I always make too much. <clears throat> Hopefully I won't eat it all tonight. So we'll see. What I have on the bottom is about two cups of spaghetti squash. And then I have about three to four ounces of diced chicken breast. I have some um, tomato sauce that I spiced up with some Italian seasoning and garlic. And then I have um, about half to three fourths of a can of fire roasted diced tomatoes. All of these things are zero smart points. And so I mix all of that together, heat it up, and then on the top I use a quarter cup of Kraft fat-free shredded mozzarella, also for zero smart points. So this entire plate is zero smart points. <clears throat> Over here we have my old friend, kind of, but wait, it's an imposter. Oh my gosh, I was so annoyed that they did not have grapefruit when I went to get this today. So I guess this is my second favorite, the peach bellini. So I have peach bellini with frozen grapes for 18 smart points, zero smart points, five smart points for my dinner, and that puts me at exactly 23 smart points for the day.